Hello, my name is Adrian Bridge. I'm the Managing Director of Taylor's Port, and I'm here to present an exciting new release that we have in the Taylor's Historical Collection. These are a series of uh, releases that we've been making, filled with some very beautiful aged tawny port from our extensive uh, cellars and blended by David Guimarães, our head winemaker. Now, back in uh, 2017, we introduced something that we call the onion. It's a typical shape of a bottle from the late 17th century. This is a, a copy of one from 1692, the year that we were founded. And we released it to celebrate our 325th anniversary as a limited edition. The market was very excited about this. You know, these things ended up in uh, becoming table lamps and all sorts of extraordinary things, but very beautiful old bottles. And what we wanted to do was to really celebrate the different types of bottles that have been used throughout our history. So the next version of it was what um, is called the chestnut. And this is um, a bottle that would have been produced around about the 1730s, 1740. The initial uh, onion was pretty much only used for serving from a cask to the table. Uh, that was also the case with the chestnut. And in a sense, now with our latest release, which is called the mallet, um, this is in fact uh, probably the first of these that was used to really be able to age wine and lay it down. So we take it out of its box like this. Uh, we've got uh, a beautiful bottle. It's actually copied from a bottle that's actually in my private collection. Um, and what we see about it, it looks fairly conventional from the front, but we have this enormous great big punt underneath. And, and this, uh, this would have been made, uh, this style back as I said, around about 17, uh, 60. Tremendously elegant, um, real stature, and of course, as I say, would have been capable of aging on its side. It's filled with this wonderful aged tawny. Um, this aged tawny itself uh, probably is, um, the blend that's been made for this one is probably around about 12 years or so, 12, 13 years in age, and as I say, is drawn from the historical um, all the wines that we have in our cellar. So we bring these beautiful elements together, fantastic wine, historic bottle, part of a collection, and indeed, we will continue to release these probably every two years. So this is a limited edition, available now, um, and uh, probably expected to be available for at least the next uh, 12 to 18 months. With that, cheers.